silk fan. Could have been used by a villager or a noble, maybe. When we washed up on this rock, the rain and wind pounded us for days. We couldn't build shelter or forage for food. Christ, we couldn't even move. It was like some enormous hand was holding us down. Just as the storm was finally breaking, Father Matthias came to us. He was calm and soft-spoken. He seemed to know us, our names, where we were from. He spoke to us in our native language, and we listened. And as we listened, he told us the truth of this island. He offered us a choice, salvation or death. Some chose to defy him, and without hesitation, he killed them then and there. Father Matthias didn't seem malicious or angry, just calm and decisive. As I stood there in the sand, wet with the blood of my comrades. I knew I could never refuse him. Transmitter from the lifeboats in it. If we don't get that back, we're not getting off this bloody island. Yeah, you need you need bandages, morphine, antiseptic. We're also in the pack. Shit. Exactly. Come here. Come on. Oh. Oh no. No 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 no. No. Oh don't do this to me, you northern bastard.
to a US Marine. Were they on the island? And do these marks represent friends lost or enemies killed? Either way, he needed a drink.
Let's get you patched up. young lady like you learn to do a thing like that? <laughs> Late shift at the Nine Bells. <laughs> Wolf's got nothing on a broken bottle. Hey, you got it. Nice work. So I assume the plan is to take that up to the radio tower. Well, it should give us the best shot of broadcasting a strong signal in every direction. Send out that SOS. And I'm not climbing anytime soon. Yeah, I was afraid you were going to say that. You can do it, Laura. After all, you're a croft. I don't think I'm that kind of croft. Sure you are. You just don't know it yet. Well, that's happened my fast letter then. Just be careful, Laura. What do they want? What are they looking for? 